Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I just have a quick crafty haul for you guys. And this haul is all about my December Daily album that I have been working on recently. And I did share the album that I picked up with you guys. Um, so I'm going to move that out the way. And um, I just recently purchased from... Um, scrapbook.com and then also from in a creative bubble so I'm just gonna gonna show you what I got from in a creative bubble first um, I did go ahead and pick up some uh, 3x4 and 4x6 uh, journaling cards also the 3x8 journaling cards from in a creative bubble and I'm just gonna share with you guys um, the ones that I did get so this was a set right here uh, this one says finding ways to create magic this holiday season. Um, this one says Christmas time is here. And I did print these out on extra heavyweight cardstock. This one says season, um, season of wonder, make merry. It says hope, love, peace, and light. This is a journaling card. This is oh what fun. It has the date, place, and the weekdays on there. This one says adding this to my ornament collection, which will be really cute um, depending on how I decide to do the tree this year. Um, this one says make, uh, Merry Making, um, a season of thought, uh, togetherness. I'm sorry, I thought it said thoughtfulness, but a season of togetherness. This is great for the family. Celebrate this season. And here is a 4x6 that said it's the most uh, wonderful time of year. Excited for the holidays. Um, and um, this set right here was all about COVID. So I did want to document a little bit about how I feel about COVID this year or what's going on with um, COVID and um, our hol holiday time. So this one says Yeti to celebrate a COVID Christmas and it has a little Yeti with the mask on. This one says it's a COVID Christmas and we're staying and we're all staying home. This one says missing blank this Christmas. This one says Bah Humbug and has the date and a place for you to write the mood days of the week uh, all decked out and masked up for the holidays I think that one's cute the holidays look different this year um, celebrating and this one has a little check off which are celebrating Christmas Hanukkah Kwanzaa Festivus uh, virtually this year um, staying home for the holidays these right here would have been perfect for 2020 which I did not complete so I still can probably use these for 2020 um, this one says a very COVID Christmas feeling kind of grinchy which is really cute this one says the reality of this season not all days are merry which is really cute as well so I wanted to incorporate that and then um, this set looks like this a little extra holiday cheer is totally needed this year um, this one says cozy times has the lady drinking her drink sitting in the, the window there with the Christmas tree joyful moments some really cute this holiday season looks like smells like sounds like tastes like feels like warm and cozy um, home sweet home really cute December tradition festivities memories here's just another journaling card here a couple of four by sixes making spirits bright okay uh, so those are really cute and I will be adding those I, I don't know why I thought I had more four by six but I didn't I guess okay and these are the three by eights which I plan to uh, hole punch and have these um, and incorporated in my album uh, on repeat and this is like a um, music playlist which is really cute um, holiday baking and I do 
really have a uh, page that I want to do for this because uh, the kids have been wanting me to make my um, oatmeal cookies the ones I make from scratch they really like those so I'll do that for this holidays this one says stories of the season uh, just another nice journaling card merry and bright December memories tis the season love this with the tags these you can place actually like pictures here as well and here's another cute one Here's another one, and I've seen some people who get this one um, put it on their cutting machine and actually cut out the little trees and whatnot and then um, add acetate. So that's a really cute one. Um, this one says Seeking Joy, Hope, Magic, Peace, and Love this holiday season. So these are some of the journaling cards that I purchased. And again, they came from in a creative bubble. And I found that website by watching um, other um, December daily process videos. Okay, so to get to my um, haul from scrapbook.com, I'm going to start off with some 12 by 12 papers. I'm just going to take them out of the package here. So I got this uh, Simple Stories Make It Merry and I got this for the cut aparts because these are cute for journaling and just adding in my album. I've been nothing but nice, just a little bit naughty, Um, maybe next year. These are really cute. So I got this page for the cut aparts but the back is also really cute. Here's another really pretty one from Simple Stories and this is from Simple Vintage Rustic Christmas and I like this one also for the cut aparts and I don't mind mixing the more serious classic looking papers with the fun papers as long as the colors kind of go together I don't mind that at all just mixing it up so I got this for the cut aparts I love the it's like a um um what's this uh, a book card um like the library book card with the santa holding his bag so this is really pretty paper and this is what the bag looks like but i mainly got it for the cut aparts here's another one that i got for the cut aparts i love this one believe in the magic it is a season to be grateful. Christmas wishes. May your days be merry and bright. All roads lead home for Christmas. These are really cute too for like filler cards and some um, journaling cards. And the back looks like that. But again, I just got it for that. Here's some 4 by 6 um, cut aparts. Peace, love, and joy. Merry and bright. Uh, I love this one. It says, Hello, Santa. Um, yeah, so from this yeah from the same collection this is a really pretty collection but um i just got it for the color cut aparts and then i got um, a few of these color play holiday recipe cards and these ones go vertical and i do plan on um maybe doing something like a cookie off not a cook off but like a cookie off because my oldest daughter wants to do chocolate chip cookies i'm gonna do my oatmeal raisin cookies and then sierra and kamari they're gonna do a cookie so i'm thinking maybe we can do like a cookie off and maybe have make it a competition so i am going to be putting my cookie recipe along with the recipe that the girls make um, I'm gonna incorporate something like that but I really like this page um, it just has the recipe cards and I like that they're going vertical so in the back so I got two of each so this is the same one in their color play holiday recipe vertical cards and here are the horizontal ones and I got two of these as well um, yeah I like that one with the little cookies so really cute so i will definitely be incorporating these into december daily because so i already have ideas based on what we said that we were going to do which is our bake our cookies so whichever day that falls on in december 
probably will be closer to Christmas that we'll do that. But that'll be one of the days in my album. Um, I also picked up this um, 6x6 uh, paper pad. And this isn't the extra large one they have one like this that's extra large that comes with like 48 sheets i just got this one because i did um get the digital 12 by 12 pack um but i wanted to get this one as well so i did pick that up because they have some really cute cut aparts in here as well and i can definitely make some tags and also do some christmas cards which i plan on coming on here and doing some Christmas cards with you guys so just I love this collection for fast and easy cards because it has so many cut aparts and you just get your card base maybe a couple embellishments um, stamp your greeting and add this to the front of the card you got easy cards so that's probably what I'm gonna do because I, I have this in the 12 by 12 that I printed out let's see I just got it all clamped because whenever I do my whenever I print my own collections um, I just you see how different these are these are so big but I was thinking these will be perfect to look at that those are really quick and easy greeting cards so if you like to make handmade um, greeting cards but you don't like to spend a whole lot of time doing it this would make really pretty greeting cards just add you some embellishments and ribbons and you know really fast and easy so it's probably what I'm gonna do for this year I'm probably gonna start um, towards the very end of this month and do so many Christmas cards so I'll see if I can do a video process of that so that was that and this is the six by six that I got and I also got let's see what else did I get and mind you this haul is all about my December daily I decided to skip on doing a lot of Halloween crafts and um, do a little bit more crafting for Christmas okay so I did get these uh, simple stories number bits and um, I got these because um, these will be cute to jazz up and add as my numbers uh, yeah so I can I can add um, stickles I can add them um, to tags so I did get those I mean I could print these or cut these on my um, Cricut but I mean it's so much easier just to just <laughs> have a pack of them so I got those and then I also got the ephemera pack for this six by six pad yeah so I got that and I also got the enamel dots as well and I also got this really nice thicker set and this is very merry um and it, i love this it says merry christmas and i may incorporate this into my title page for my december daily this says be jolly season's greetings merry and bright on the back says hey santa uh christmas magic ho 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 cozy hello in december so i may use this to do my title page because that's what I've been um, thinking about here recently what am I going to do for my title page oh, I'm going to drop some of my journal cards down here alrighty let's see I dropped them all on the floor here so I'll just get these together okay 
so that's that and then um, I did get these Tim Holtz um, baseboard frames and these are really cute to incorporate too so this uh, I'm not really sure I may have to watch a couple of videos it says transparency right there but anyway these are those frames these are really really cute I love these I, I always get these little frames and I end up using one or two and then I end up stuck with like a whole pack that I just never seem to get around using but I got those I'm definitely gonna use those somewhere in this uh, book my book may end up chunky because I have so many ideas and right now I'm really motivated so, okay, so I also got this Tim Holtz uh, Ideology trim tape, and this is the Christmas one. It has the one with the that's black with the white writing that says uh, Merry Little Christmas. Uh, has the green plaid, the red stripes, also the silver metallic and gold metallic. I'm, I'm, probably don't need any washi but I wanted to get some specifically for Christmas for my album and this is the simple stories jingle all the way and this is the um, red and black like plaid this is the little car uh, with the Christmas tree on top and the poinsettias so, and then because I do want to incorporate a shaker pocket I got these sprinklets um, St. Nick and that's really cute. You see, it has the little has it has the little Santa face and like all the little candy sprinkles. I thought that would be cute to add in um, to add in a sequin mix and do a shaker pocket. So that's another plan of mine. Um, and this little bag that that came in is perfect for my cards that I printed out, I think. Yep. I'm put them right in there. And then last but not least, I got, um, this, another We Are uh, Memory Keepers punch board. And this is the tag punch board, which <sighs> I probably didn't need this, but... I wanted it <laughs> so you can create tags from 1 inch to 3.5 inches wide and so yeah I'll just add it to my punch board collection so that is my haul and I will be coming back really soon with another video um, showing you guys my December daily as a matter of fact, since I have the camera rolling, I can show you this cut file that I uh, purchased last year for my December daily. And it's this one, um, this December cut file. If I can find this, I, I, I bought it, I believe, on Etsy last year. I'm sure it was yet last year because that was going to be my first time attempting the December daily. Um, so I... Um, decided to use this cut file again for this um, 2021 um, so I cut it a few times I cut cut it to uh, mat this paper on the back and the wood grain on the front and then I cut the outline in that metallic red and I thought that was really cute but I still need a title page so that's what I've been thinking about I thinking I probably will put my reason why here um, after this um, but I want to do a title page with some kind of a transparency so another page that I added for this 2021 December daily is our movie so usually in December when all those Christmas movies are on we usually watch some sort of a Christmas movie um, so I just added all of our favorite Christmas movies so um, the kids 
told me their favorite Christmas movie, my husband and I. So, of course, I love Home Alone, the, the, the first one, the original Home Alone. That's my favorite Christmas movie. And um, so, my husband, his favorite Christmas movie is a Charlie Brown Christmas and then uh, my son, he says Friday after next. He's so funny. And then um, Nala, she likes a Christmas story. That is one. That's another one of my favorites. Um, Sierra likes the Grinch that stole Christmas, and Kamari she likes the Polar Express. But so I will be incorporating our movie day or movie night whichever night that is in December when we sat down to watch Christmas movies um, and sometimes it's not even planned um, those movies will come on and we just find ourselves watching them so whatever night or day that happens to be on that's what you know that's where it will be in this book so I'm just thinking that I might put a large number um, for the day um, whenever that time comes so of course these pages won't be done um, these are just basically the base foundation pages that I've been working on so I thought that was really cute I printed this out um, as a print and cut from Cricut it says Christmas movies and chill so that'll probably be what we're gonna do um, whatever day in December that is that we sit down to watch Christmas movies so and I'll uh, and right here I made this a flip out because I'll probably be putting a story um, journaling here or here so and I just have this number paper clip holding it for now but I'm gonna try to find some holiday ones like Christmas tree or something like that um, but yeah so I will come back and do uh, more sharing with you guys as I get my foundation pages uh, all set up and um, that'll do it for this video if you guys like this video please give me a thumbs up if you're not subscribed and you would like to click the link to subscribe feel free to comment and I will see you guys in my next video bye